Welcome back to Friday Night Lights on Fox 12 Oregon, presented by Pacific Office Automation. Well, playing for a state title in a National Women's Soccer League Championship, Portland Thorns star goalkeeper Bella Bixby, of course, a familiar name around here. First starring at Rex Putnam High, then Oregon State, on to the Thorns, and back now to her alma mater as head coach, the Kingsmen. We were in Milwaukee this week as the RPHS kids keep a close eye on their rock star coach in D.C. High School Spotlight, sponsored by Subaru. Subaru loves learning. That closed, another chance, save. What a save by Bixby. Soccer is a big part of my life, but it is fun to go and help these kids fall in love with the sport. Thorns keeper Bella Bixby is a proud Putnam grad. So too is her high school and college sweetheart, husband and assistant coach, Elliot Bixby. This has been, you know, her dream for, for a very long time. Elliot and Bella are from the Kingsman class of 2014. OSU Beaver grads four years later, and fast forward to this magical fall where Rex Putnam is a top 10 club in the 5A rankings. One, two, three, two, three. It's definitely tough, but having uh, Elliot help me is good because we travel here and there, but you know, I've got training in the morning and then I have high school in the evening. All right, here we go. The Bixby's have been running the program back in their old stomping grounds for the past two seasons. Towards my senior year, that's when I was kind of um, kind of falling out of love with soccer, if you will. I was still obviously very much involved with soccer just because of Bella and, and everything that she does. But honestly, this, this group of girls really kind of rejuvenated, you know, my, my enjoyment and my love for the sport. Having them step in was a better fit for most of the girls on the team. Everyone felt more comfortable. Ariana Barney is a holding midfielder for Putnam and her club team, the Washington Timbers. Ari is one of the standouts during this resurgence of the program under the good vibes only with the Bixby's. They bring more encouragement, I'd say, than the last few years. And they keep things more positive and they run the practice more smoothly. And everyone listens very intently because it's kind of cool having a Thorns player as your coach. They've just been like really consistent and patient with us and just like keeps pushing us to be our best because they know we can be our best and we can be probably one of the best teams in the state. Thorns Academy goalie and Putnam Jr. Haley Patlin is pulling double duty in net for football and kicking for Kingsman football, just like Coach Bella did nearly a decade ago. She also teaches like outside of soccer, like just like life skills. <laughs> Learning how to be like a better person and it's just like more than soccer, you know? Yeah. But even though soccer is life. <laughs> While Bixby was away for the biggest match of her season, on senior night she wasn't there. It's okay, though. The eight-member class of 2023 will still be around when Coach comes back for the playoff run, perhaps with some new hardware of her own to bring back to Milwaukee. Good luck, Bella! Always good to meet some good seeds and people doing good deeds, of course. Phil, sit on your kid who deserves some time in the Fox 12 High School Spotlight. We had another bonus edition of the Spotlight of Night Ago from Oregon City. Three Rivers League champion volleyball team out there. The Pioneers saw senior night as Sammy Knight. 17-year-old captain Sammy Keatley is the lone senior in the OC, and she's been in Pioneer Court with her assistant coach dad, Doug, since the age of five. Doug's been there for 30 years. Smiling Sammy wants to study pre-med, become a doctor, and she's just what her bull riding father ordered, also as a member of the National Honor Society. There's Duke of Dakota. You can catch that feature story now on kptv.com. The volleyball championships will be held next weekend. Band time! watching Friday Night Lights on Fox 12 Oregon, presented by Pacific Office Automation.